I was up there with the creators of the universe. It was a dimension that I don't think I've ever been in before with that. Uh, it was just, uh, it, I don't know how you say it, I guess it was cosmic or something. Boy, I've never been up in that kind of a level. I mean, you know, there are gods and demigods and great white lights and the great white spirit, but this was way up there. The white spirit or whatever was the one that sucked me up right through and into the physical sun and out here somewhere. And uh, they were speaking, you know, there was, there was music of a, of a sort. It was magnificent stuff. And... Uh, they told me things. And they're blowing on eagle bone whistles. They have sage wreaths around their arms, head, and ankles. They have eagle feathers pinned into their skin. And they pull until the skin breaks loose. It's called ripping flesh. And it took three hours, slowly getting into a trance, building up the natural opiates in the body, flooding the body with natural opiates to get ready for the next part of the ceremony which was hanging, this is the real Sioux Indian sun dance where you hang, usually either from your back or from your chest. And at this point, you can't physically do this without leaving your body, without actually having an out of the body experience and hanging around with the energies upstairs. He did this for 20 minutes. And I spoke with him when, when he came down, his eyes were alight, he was so excited, he said it was like going up and running around with a heard of thundering horses. The energy was so powerful and so strong. He looked around the site and he said, we chose a good site. It was, a, it was done right. And I always wanted to do this right. This does look pretty bizarre, but in the context that I presented it, maybe you get some idea of, of uh, what my latest work has been about and how I've gradually um, reached this point. And um, I've been working with a man who claims that he leaves his body and talks to God. And Think about that for a while. I certainly have. So I'd better stop and say thank you. <laughs> <laughs>